Welcome to today's video where we're delving into the world of financial success. Now, let's get one thing straight. Financial success isn't just about having a staggering number of zeros in your bank account. No, it's about much more than that. It's about financial security, the kind that gives you a good night's sleep, knowing that you're prepared for whatever life might throw at you. It's about financial freedom, the kind that lets you live your life on your own terms, without being shackled by financial constraints. And let's not forget about peace of mind, the kind that comes when you're not constantly worried about money. It's about being able to enjoy the fruits of your labor without the constant worry of financial ruin. Keep watching to find the 10 clear signs that you have made it financially in this world. Welcome to Money Funnel. Firstly, you've made it financially if you have an emergency fund that can cover at least six months of living expenses. Now let's unpack this a bit. An emergency fund, what is it? Well, it's a stash of money set aside to cover the financial surprises life throws your way. These unexpected events can be stressful, not to mention expensive. Think of it like a financial safety net. It's there to catch you when you fall, preventing a minor hiccup from becoming a major catastrophe. Without one, you're walking a financial tightrope, vulnerable to any gust of wind that life might blow your way. Having an emergency fund provides peace of mind. It's knowing that you can weather a storm, whether that's a sudden job loss, a medical emergency, or an unexpected home repair. It's about preparedness, and it's about control. So if you've got a solid emergency fund, pat yourself on the back. If you've got this covered, you're already on the right track. Another clear sign of financial success is being debt-free. Now let's unpack that a little. You see, debt is like an anchor, dragging down your financial health. It's a constant reminder of money owed, a burden that hinders your progress towards financial freedom. It's the money you have to pay back, often with hefty interest, before you can start building your own wealth. Being debt-free, on the other hand, is a significant milestone on the road to financial success. It means you've managed to break free of the chains of debt, and you're now in control of your income. You're no longer working to pay off past expenses, but instead, every cent you earn is yours to invest, save, or spend as you see fit. This isn't to say that all debt is bad. Some debts, like a mortgage or student loans, can be seen as investments in your future. But overall, the less debt you have, the better. If you're debt-free, give yourself a pat on the back. On sign number three, you have a steady income stream. Having a consistent flow of income, whether it's from a full-time job, a part-time gig, a thriving business, or well-managed investments, is a critical piece of the financial stability puzzle. It's like the heartbeat of your financial health constantly pumping life into your economic sphere. Steady income allows you to meet your financial obligations without the stress of wondering where the money is going to come from. It's the foundation that allows you to build, to save, to invest, and to plan for the future. It's the springboard that enables you to bounce back from unexpected expenses without getting knocked off track. So if you have a regular income stream that comfortably covers your needs and allows room for your wants, give yourself a pat on the back. You're doing just fine. A steady income is a clear sign of financial stability. Next up, you're able to save regularly. This is more than just stashing away a few dollars each payday. It's a disciplined, consistent practice that contributes significantly to your financial well-being. Having a regular savings habit is like building a financial safety net, preparing you for unexpected expenses, and setting the groundwork for future investments. Think of it like this. Each dollar you save is a brick in your financial fortress. The more bricks you have, the stronger your fortress becomes. And over time, these bricks can turn into a castle of financial stability and freedom. It's not about how much you save, but rather the consistency and discipline of your saving habit. Regular savings can start from as little as the cost of a cup of coffee each day. The key is to make saving a regular activity, just like brushing your teeth. So, if you're saving regularly, you're definitely on the right path. Sign number five, you're investing for the future. Investing isn't just about putting your money to work, it's about creating a roadmap to your financial freedom. It's about growing your wealth, not just maintaining it. It's about ensuring that your money isn't just sitting idle in a bank account, but instead is working for you, multiplying, and creating more wealth. Investing is a deliberate strategy aimed at realizing long-term financial goals. It could be investing in stocks, bonds, real estate, or even a small business. The point is to let your money create more money. As the saying goes, don't work for money, make it work for you. Remember, investing isn't a get-rich-quick scheme. 
It's a marathon, not a sprint. It's about consistency, patience, and understanding the markets. It's about making informed decisions and being prepared for the ups and downs in the market. If you're investing, you're not just thinking about today but also your future. Another clear sign of financial success is having a good credit score. It's like a financial report card, reflecting how responsibly you've managed your money. It takes into account factors like how promptly you've paid your bills, the amount of debt you carry, and the length of your credit history, among other things. A good credit score doesn't just happen overnight. It's built over time, with consistent and disciplined financial behavior. It's a testament to your ability to manage and repay debt responsibly. And it's not just about getting loans or credit cards. A good credit score can help you secure better interest rates, save money in the long run, and even influence things like renting an apartment or getting a cell phone plan. In essence, a good credit score is a reflection of your financial health and stability. It's a badge of honor, a symbol of your financial maturity and acumen. A good credit score opens up opportunities and is a sign of financial health. Sign number seven, you have insurance. Insurance, my friends, is the unsung hero of financial stability. It's like a safety net, ready to catch you when life throws a curveball your way. Think about it. What if a storm damages your house or an unexpected health issue arises? With insurance, you're covered. Insurance not only provides a financial buffer against these unforeseen shocks, but it also gives you peace of mind. Whether it's home, health, life, or auto insurance, each policy plays a vital role in protecting your financial health. It's not about being pessimistic. It's about being prepared. It's the financial equivalent of having an umbrella on a sunny day, because when the rain comes, and it inevitably will, you'll be glad you have it. And remember, being insured is not a one-time deal. It's a commitment to regularly review your policies and ensure they match your ever-evolving needs. Insurance is a key piece of the financial success puzzle. Sign number eight, you're able to live comfortably. Now, what does this mean exactly? Well, it's all about being able to afford a lifestyle that you're content with without constantly fretting over money. Imagine this, you're in a position where you can treat yourself to that occasional fancy dinner or splurge on a vacation without it causing you financial stress. You don't spend nights awake, worrying about making ends meet or whether you can afford those unexpected expenses. Instead, you're able to manage your expenses with ease and have enough left over for the fun stuff. This doesn't mean living lavishly, but rather, living within your means, with a sense of financial peace and security. This is a sign that you've made it financially because it means you've built a solid foundation of financial stability. You're not just surviving, you're thriving. And that, my friends, is a wonderful place to be. Living comfortably is a clear indication of financial success. Sign number nine, you're financially literate. Ah, uh, financial literacy, the ninth sign that you've made it financially. What does it mean to be financially literate? It means understanding the basics, how to balance a checkbook, the difference between stocks and bonds, how interest rates work, and the impact of inflation on your savings. But it doesn't stop there. Being financially literate goes beyond just understanding. It's about using this knowledge to make informed decisions about your money. Why is this so important? Well, financial literacy is the compass guiding your journey to financial freedom. It helps you navigate through the complexities of financial markets, avoid potential pitfalls, and seize opportunities when they present themselves. It's about knowing how to grow and protect your wealth. And guess what? You don't need a finance degree to be financially literate, just a commitment to continuous learning and staying informed. If you're financially literate, you're in a strong position to make sound financial decisions. And finally, sign number 10, you have financial goals and are working towards them. This is more than just wishing for a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. It's about setting concrete, achievable objectives. Maybe you're saving for a down payment on a house, or perhaps you're working towards paying off your student loan. Whatever your goal, having one and actively pursuing it is a sign that you're in control of your financial destiny. Having financial goals gives you a roadmap, a compass that directs your money decisions. It ensures that every dollar you earn has a purpose and isn't just frittered away. This kind of focused financial strategy is what separates those who just get by from those who truly thrive. So if you're tracking your progress, sticking to your budget, and consistently moving closer to your financial goals, give yourself a pat on the back. If you're working towards your financial goals, you're well on your way to financial success. So there you have it, 10 clear signs you've made it financially. From having an emergency fund and being debt-free, to maintaining a steady income stream and saving regularly. 
If you're investing for the future, have a good credit score, and are insured, you're certainly on the right track. Living comfortably, being financially literate, and actively working towards your financial goals are also key indicators of your financial success. These signs are not just benchmarks, but they're also stepping stones to greater financial freedom and stability. They provide a framework to assess your own financial health and progress. If you've ticked off all these signs, congratulations! If not, don't fret. It's never too late to start. And remember, financial success is not about reaching a specific endpoint. It's about the journey, the habits you form, the decisions you make, and the knowledge you acquire along the way. Remember, financial success is a journey, not a destination. Keep striving, keep learning, and keep growing your wealth. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe and help our channel grow. Don't forget to hit that like and notification bell for more motivational and financial tip videos.